Pokemon Go is probably the easiest Pokemon game to get shinies in, with events like Community Day happening every month. They also have limited time research events where you can get a Pokemon like Shiny Celebi, so I can imagine a lot of you watching have shinies and legendaries in this game. For those looking to bring some cool Pokemon into Scarlet and Violet, I'll be showing you today how to transfer Pokemon from Pokemon Go to Pokemon Home, and then over to Scarlet and Violet. If this video helps you out in any way, then definitely subscribe because I have a lot of Pokemon Home content coming out. Thank you guys for watching, and let's get into it. So, the first thing you guys are going to want to do is tap on the Pokeball and then go up to Settings, and what you want to do is scroll all the way down to Connected Devices and Services, and you'll see Pokemon Home right here. If you haven't linked Pokemon Home in the past, you can just tap on it, and right here you're given the option to sign in with Nintendo. So, I'm going to do that, and then we'll be back. I now have my Nintendo account linked with Pokemon Home, so the button right here says Send Pokemon. And when you tap on that, you have this button that says Go Transporter Energy. If this bar right here is all the way full to a bluish purple, that's a good thing. That means that your energy is not used up, meaning you could transfer Pokemon. Because for some reason, when you transfer them, you can see the bar goes red. It's based on what Pokemon you pick. So for example, this is Suey and Quillfish. It's not too special. Same with Coughing. So it doesn't really move the bar at all. There's only a little pixel of red right there. If I were to only want to transfer Pokemon like Dialga though, that are rare legendaries or shinies, you can see the bar fills up very quickly. Here's some shiny Pokemon. I could tap on these. And yeah, the bar goes red real quick. This is a limitation in Pokemon Go, and I believe you have to wait like a week for the bar to be fully recharged once it goes all the way down, or you could pay or something like that. It's kind of dumb, but no matter how it works, there's nothing I can do about it. So I'm going to pick some Pokemon like Starly because I have a lot right here from Starly Community Day. Here's some legendary Pokemon. I'm going to transfer up a Zapdos. I believe Dino is not in Scarlet and Violet, so can't do that. And this Groudon, you can see it's a weird color. That's because even with that much blue left, I don't have enough room. I would need probably the entire bar to actually transfer this up. Here's a good one, Wooper. Wooper is definitely in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, so I'm going to do that. And I'm going to pick one more Pokemon, so I guess let's pick a Legendary. You can go in here and search, or you can just tap on a button like Legendary. I guess we'll do a Dialga, why not? Let's transfer in a Dialga too. And when you're all done, you can press on Next, and just go over. You can review the Pokemon that you tapped on, and click on Transport. And this will send them directly to Pokemon Home. There we go, it says you've sent your Pokemon to Pokemon Home, so you can open the app and finish moving your Pokemon. Now that you've done this, there's nothing else you need to do on your mobile device, so I'm gonna go over to my Nintendo Switch. So now that you've transferred Pokemon in from Pokemon Go to Pokemon Home, you can go over here to the Pokemon Go button, and once you click on it, it should have that little red circle icon. It'll now be searching from the Pokemon Go transfer system, and it shows right there my Starly, Zapdos, Shiny Wooper, and my Dialga. Just click on Receive, it should only take a couple seconds, and then boom, that's pretty much all you have to do. The final thing you need to do now is simply drag and drop from Pokemon Home over to your save file, and for now, I'm just gonna bring over Zapdos, Wooper, and Dialga. The reason for this is because at the time of recording, the home update is not actually out yet, so I have to bring these over to Pokemon Shield for the example. Now once you're back in Pokemon Scarlet or Violet, after saving on Pokemon Home, you can open up your PC boxes and you should see your Pokemon right here. It really is that simple, you just drag and drop from the Pokemon Home app and the Pokemon will all appear in your PC boxes in game. If this video helped you out, please subscribe to my channel because I'm on my way to 45,000 subscribers and there's a lot of Pokemon Home hype right now that you don't want to miss. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I'll see you guys soon, peace out everyone. One.